Hi guys, so it's officially our five year anniversary weekend, which we're both pretty excited about. So of course, where else would we go but to a wedding show? Because that's totally what Brandon wants to do the most. Yep. <laughs> Definitely not sleeping on my Sunday. No, 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 no. Well, you slept in until seven. I think that's long enough. I do. <laughs> so anyway, what we're going to be doing is we're going to show you a whole bunch of vendors and just um, show you kind of what the place is like. So it's around about $18 a ticket. And um, I'm keen to get my wedding research on because I kind of live and breathe this stuff and just show you like any of the interesting options that are around there. So let's get going. And he will tell you whether the stone in there is a thousand dollars on So good luck.
Yeah, figured a lot out. So yeah, got some good ideas and some actual contacts where we now know where to go. I'm glad that we went to the grand wedding show because um, the Lauren and Delwyn product I've been looking at um, a lot of their pictures online and it's very authentic so it's good to actually meet them and they seem like they're lovely people they definitely like to talk <laughs> um, and it was good to see our jeweler again because um, he's doing really well so it was yeah, just nice really well. it's a very good opportunity to see them and yeah so I would definitely recommend going but the biggest recommendation I would say is pre-buy your tickets because we waited in the queue for around about 40 minutes so if you can definitely do that <laughs> I wanted to show you guys the stuff that we got from the grand wedding show so we got quite a bit now I am fairly interested in the whole live stream thing so um, I mean we could potentially look at doing this ourselves which is why I'm a bit interested in it but there is a company that apparently does it so I found this really interesting because I've got some people overseas that might not be able to actually join us for the wedding so that's a really good way to include them. These photographers seem quite nice but these guys are who I'm really interested in so it's a Lauren and Delwyn product. I've been looking at a bunch of their stuff and they're really genuine lovely people so um, please don't go stealing them too much from me but uh, honestly they just seem to be like the nicest people um, so I'm really really keen on actually getting them. And uh, Bloom, they did some really fancy nice lighting and uh, floors, so that's a good thing to bear in mind. And I'm also getting some guest book ideas from these guys. And ball gowns and bridles, so if you're in New Zealand and you're okay with travelling a little bit more out west. Okay, so they're out in Henderson. Um, so they've got a bunch of stuff which could really, really work um, for, you know, just trying things on because I don't think that they actually charge to try on. Now, that beautiful um, archway that you guys saw, that's from Covers and I've seen their stuff a bit. It looked really lovely in real life. I kind of fell in love with this one when I saw them online. But the one from the show, I think that's like a fairly expensive option because they had like all of the um, pretty beading and all of that stuff on it. So, yep. This is just another thing to consider though I am kind of besotted with this because I love cherry blossoms and it's so pretty. He is an amazing jeweler and I cannot recommend him higher so Julian Bartram, amazing amazing person. Um, so yeah if you are looking to get your ring designed or anything like that do check him out. Um, I saw this place as well so um, we're interested in hiring suits because uh, you know how often are you really going to wear your wedding suit. So I think it was actually the works we were looking at getting, or maybe the professional. So the, the prices are actually really reasonable. This is the range that they said that they've got right now, but by the time that we're getting married in two years, they'll have a wider range. I'm quite keen on a grey look. So yeah, that's kind of like our experience. So as you can see, I am back home now and like getting ready with my headphones to um, just do some cleaning. But I'm really, really glad that we went there and just sort of like got an idea for the sort of things we're after and like it got Brandon a bit more involved and like interested in the whole thing. A good way to actually um, tackle these sorts of shows is definitely just talk to the vendors because like even though a couple of the photographers like we sort of like their style, hi Pixie, but in person they just weren't like, they weren't genuine. So it's a really good opportunity to actually meet the vendors, see what they're all about and just see things kind of up close. If you are going to be going to those shows, try not to get too wowed, try not to get too sucked into anything. Don't sign up for the subscriptions. Like you've got Pinterest, you've got all sorts of other stuff. You don't need the subscriptions to um, everything. You just, you don't need it. I'm going to be taking Brandon because you could tell how much he loved going to this show. Um, so we're going to the bride and groom show which is in two weeks and I'll also be doing a vlog of that and I think they've got a bunch of different vendors there as well so I'll be interested in showing you guys that too. So thank you guys so much for watching and subscribe to the channel. Please give this video a thumbs up if you found it useful and uh, congratulations if you have gotten engaged because I know it's a really really exciting time in your life and uh, even someone that's been thinking about this for a long time, it's a bit daunting when you're actually thinking about that along with all the other responsibilities of life and just costs and just your mind potentially running away. <laughs>
especially with your imagination when you've been dreaming of this sort of stuff for years and then you realize that your actual budget is like this and your expectations are like <sighs> crazy so um yeah that's why i wanted to do this to help people that are also in a very similar boat you don't have people to help you out with everything you don't have the money to like hire everything or just buy everything brand new so yeah that's why i'm doing this and i really look forward to bringing you guys on this journey and uh, hopefully at the end of it we'll both have learned something because <laughs> that would be great so thank you again so much and i'll see you again soon bye